May 29, Friday of the 7th week of Easter A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John After Jesus has revealed himself to his disciples and eaten breakfast with them, he said to Simon Peter, Simon, son of John, do you love me more than this? He said to him, Yes, Lord, you know that I love you. He said to him, Feed my lambs. He then said to him a second time, Simon, son of John, do you love me? He said, Yes, Lord, you know that I love you. He said to him, Tend my sheep. He said to him the third time, He said to him the third time, Simon, son of John, do you love me? Peter was distressed that he had said to him a third time, Do you love me? And he said to him, Lord, you know everything. You know that I love you. Jesus said to him, Feed my sheep. Amen, amen, I say to you. When you were younger, you used to dress yourself and go where you wanted. But when you grow old, you will stretch out your hands and someone else will dress you and lead you where you want to go. He said this signifying by what kind of death he would glorify God. And when he had said this, He said to him, Follow me. The Gospel of the Lord Simon, son of John, do you love me? Jesus asks this question three times as if to counteract Peter's threefold denial when Jesus was arrested in Gethsemane. In the first two questions, do you love me? Jesus uses the Greek word agape referring to a love that entails the whole person's will and readiness for sacrificial love. Peter responds using filio, affective love. In the third question, Jesus comes down to Peter's level. The apostles answer, Yes, Lord, you know that I love you, is a profession of faith, trust, and belief in Jesus. Assured of Peter's undying loyalty, Jesus entrusts the community of believers to Peter with the repeated command, Feed my lambs, tend my sheep, and feed my sheep. Jesus is not mistaken in choosing Simon as the leader, the rock, Kepas, Petros, on which he will build his church. Peter is now ready to follow Jesus. Jesus.